Hi, are you an early bird or a night owl? Did you ever hear someone blame you get up so late and you feel so shamed you wake up late and you sleep too much? Today I'm going to share with you why we have the early bird and why we have the night oil. Actually, this is nothing to be blamed or be shamed. It's all because we have different genes. Hello everyone, this is Jessica. In this channel, I share my self-development tips and experience. Hope you will learn something useful. Uh, do you ever have the experience? On a Sunday morning, you have the great breakfast and you went to visit a friend at 10 o'clock. And when you knock the door, knock, 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 and find out he or she did not get up yet. Oh, he is so lazy. He probably is just a night owl. A person get used to sleep late and get up late. It's just different lifestyle. So why we will have the early bird and night owl? We can trace back all those habits, different sleep patterns before our industry. So before our industry, we highly rely on plants. And we all know plants need sunlight. That's why we all need to get up early to get the maximum time for the sunlight, to plant the seeds, watering the plants, fertilize them, and make the maximum harvest season. Since these things have to be done before the sunset, and that's actually the time we have all those quotes saying like early bird has more food. Our history told us our human being is group animals. We live together, we protect each other. Because we don't have a lot of like uh, weapons, so people live together. One group of people need to stay up late to protect the other group when they are asleep. So that naturally will divide the big group to two sets. One group of people will get up early during the walk and the other people will uh, stay up late to protect the early bird group. So if you are a night owl, uh, is there some way you can change your patterns? You can feel the energy and you can feel so much power you will feel so happy in the early morning yes you can so scientists has to experiment they compel people in the countryside with the people living in the city and they find out the people living in the countryside actually sleep much earlier than the people in the city what caused this difference it's very interesting. It's actually the sunlight. The much more sunlight we are exposed to, our body and our mind will understand, oh, this is the daytime. So when the night happens, all the light has disappeared. Oh my, immediately know, okay, it's the night time. I need to go to sleep. I need to have the rest. But compared to the countryside people, people living in the cities, right? They are always working in the buildings. Uh, like 90% of the time they will stay inside. So that means they won't have enough time exposed to the sun. So the mind will get confused. It doesn't have the clear boundary between the night and daytime. So that's why when the night actually happens, the sunset happens, the body will still think uh, it's very similar to the daytime. I don't think it's the time for sleep yet. So to fix that, uh, exposing yourself to the more sunlight, like for example, riding the bicycle to the company, um, or like during the lunchtime, get outside, having some sunlight, walking on the street, will help you to fix that body sensitivities 
it can understand more between the day and night. So that will help you to sleep earlier and have better sleep. I uh, hope this video helped you a lot. Uh, if you find this video has the good information to you, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I will see you next time. Bye!